So in case you haven't noticed, Dota is really hard to be good at, which is why I watch the pros. So we grab the best plays from ESL1 Birmingham just for you. Let's get to it. Welcome to your Dota 2 Plays of the Week. Century Ward, they see Yapso, that's why S4 is going side to side, but the stun is a double with the Mass Serpent Wars. S4 is trapped inside the Wukong's command, Creep wants to help out, but what can he do? He can put down oh the arena and the water skewer with the Fatal Fun! Team Secret, they are bleeding together! Team Secret, they have to get the hell out with what they've got! They're into yours. Army oh, still in the area, he's, he's gonna, gonna be careful. He's gonna have to start Mammy into the back, he wants to get with the wall! Oh, a great setup! Nisha's in trouble, but he still managed to finish up the darks here! But Nisha, he's about to fall here, his first life is gone! A very healthy Ame, but x is being beaten down by this uh, Golem as he takes out from the flame break, bit by bit. Looks like the Radiant's burn, they will be able to find him. Ame, as his link is broken, they're gonna try and haunt over into him, but he's underneath their shrine right now, and I think Seeker realizing that they're not so sure about this fight. Zyde's gonna keep the Seeking Napalm up, but they're just gonna go for every other hero. Why? That is it, Ame. He does manage to get the purge, and he's gonna be breaking Nisha for a little while, but Ame wants to be able to get Zai instead. He's being kited so much by this. He's got the ult. He's out with the last one. He's holding it down. Nisha beating a one, two, three, and that's it. Five dead from LG with no buyback. Balls we could use that to get into the fight. Meanwhile, the wall comes up, mid one, trapped inside the arena of blood, and here's the mail. It is the electric hole bringing them all in together. Three heroes down. A buyback can come out from the PA right now if they're going to try and fight this. And if not, they're basically giving it up. They will take the top lane of ranks here, evil geniuses. He's waiting on top of this high ground here. Zai is going to jump in Roll onto in, Snail. actually lands onto the SF. He pops his BKB, picks up the bounty rune. S4 in the back line. Look at that Dream Coil. Locking down the four of them. There is going to be the BKB activated, but they're wasting so much time trying to oh, kill S4. The triple Meanwhile, race. Just controlling up everybody right now. Yaps are the last shot to the high ground. It's going to be able to find him for the Ultra Kill. He wants it. Mail. And now the Silence slow down onto Mid-1, who no longer has his BKB. What a setup from S4 with just a beautiful initiation. Spells, just because Thompson wanted to pop ulti earlier before the stuns came out yep. to zone to kill Rax. TNC get the damage off first, so it's more of appeal. OG didn't feel powerful oh, enough good spin. to pursue. Starts it off, knew that Tim's is going to initiate in the raw Soulbind again. The Soulbind came a little bit later, however. Oh but my the god, the Fatal Bond! The Fatal Bond! I fun! told you! They have just destroyed them! inside the army of the monkeys that's just not gonna work out for you smoke up from evil genie the same from team secret once again yaps are on the front line the it's a three man stop three man stop three man stop yes three man kill eg they are the real three even though they're guaranteed two they'll lose another one to mount push back out but mid one's chasing him down one more punch will do it themselves just recently taking that safe lane tower Oh, Puppy. I'm gonna Think start this right it. now. Zai. Zai with the Invis rune. Uh, Puppy really wants to force these heroes into a bad position. That's where the Ravage goes. Puppy, oh. three man by Paul set up with the Invis rune jumping in on top of beautiful team fight. All baited by Captain Puppy. No haunt. How do you fight when you know that both cores of Secret will be able to fully cast their spells? Back, no follow-up stun. The Orchid Silence was going to be there, but Team Secret not getting the perfect combination. Nisha pushed over, not held up on the high ground. However, he'll ensnare over on Arteezy. He's a frontliner with no mana, and around the Dark Sea Wall, the Shackles holding him down. Buyback is available, so Arteezy can rejoin this fight instantly. They need the rock, they need something. The Gladiator Pit has been dropped. Fly, now he'll drop the rock. Combining with the Fertile Bonds, Team Secret is all connected together. They had some dispels. They need a spear, they need something to hit. They only pop the A on this as Puppy. He's in the trees looking for his own shackle under the cover of their ghost. Oh, the the double stun from Yamsel. They've got the control. They've got the control of this fight. And they've got EG down calling QG. It's done. Team Secret in five games. Congratulations to Team Secret for taking the big dub in ESL. How will Secret do this year? Are they the best team in EU? Drop a comment down below and let us know. And if you want more esports coverage, check us out on Esports in 30 on Mondays to Fridays at 8.30 p.m. EST. And drop a follow on all our socials at Squad State.